All right, we are back. The game is now on. Sorry about the restart, guys. We're having some issues with Rage 2 and OBS, where it, it really doesn't play nice, and it forces us to restart OBS sometimes because we lose the window capture. But regardless, welcome back, everybody. Make sure to hit that refresh button. Costa Kitty, thank you for that retweet. Much appreciated. How's everybody doing? Welcome in. Sylvie, welcome back. Love how I can just type twit on the address bar and it takes me to Twitch. <laughs> that makes sense. How's it going, guys? Welcome in. At the end of another long day, victory has been achieved and it's time for games. Basil, come over here, buddy. Basil has just eaten a spider. Unka Ed, welcome back, my friend. Thank you for the 500 bits. And hello, Michelle, how's it going? Basil has caught his first spider, guys. I'm proud, buddy. <laughs> Hello, everybody. Welcome in. Basil, you caught your first spider, buddy? Nice. Good work. Yeah, who's a good boy? Good job, buddy. Now, the question is... <laughs> Th Whoa! Unka Ed, thank you for the sub gifts! My lord! What is going on? Oh, enjoy your gifts, guys. Let's see, who do we have here? Let me, let me go over to my... My god, thank you, Unka! That is amazing, dude. That is incredible. And why doesn't it let me do this on OBS? There we go. I want to see my full chat. My God! Michelle, Tokyo Dawn, Trolley Bear, Elephants on Acid, enjoy your subs. Enjoy your emotes, loyalty badges. Oh boy. It's payday, boys. Payday with Unka Ed. Thank you, my friend. I really appreciate it. Is it Unka or Unka? I want to... I want to pronounce it correctly. Thank you very much. How's everybody doing? Michelle, how's it going? Congrats, I hope you gave him a treat. I don't have treats handy. Now here's the question. Do I allow him to eat the spider? It's a little dark of a, of a question, I suppose. Do we let him eat the spider? Or should we just like, you know, not do that? <laughs> I just punched my cat accidentally, what the hell? <laughs> I'm getting dark too. Is it because you're getting tanned, Suvi? <laughs> How's it going, everybody? I hope you've had a good day. You know, one thing that I think I, I was talking with Idbarit, a regular here in the channel, and one thing that's very common um, you know, he, he said, you know, just another day, like any other day, just giving to the community. Dude, thank you very much. It's very, very generous and appreciated. Spiders are a great provider of sustenance. Basil, do you want to eat the spider? What do you guys think? Do you think he's going to eat it if I give it to him? Let's see. Hey, buddy. Bats are on, guys. One says he eats it. Two, he doesn't. Cats eat anything? I don't know. I've never, I've never gone through this with with Basil here. You eating it, buddy? You eat it? I think he's eating it. Good boy, Basil. Good boy. Two. 
You were wrong, stoic gamer. Welcome back, buddy. He ate it, boys. And girls. He ate it. What a powerful lad I have there. But anyways, one thing that, you know, is very common is for, for when you ask someone about their day, they will tell you, yeah, just another day, like as if every day is the same. That's a dangerous slope, isn't it? If you truly feel, look at those emotes. If you truly feel that every day is the same, that is a path to the dark side, boys. His first confirmed kill. Oh yeah, I love that. <laughs> See, buddy? Good job. That is a dangerous slope. And beyond that, it, it's not true. Even, I don't care if you're shoveling shit every day, you know? Every day, it's... Things are slightly different. And it could be just only slightly different. But if you're paying enough attention, you'll notice differences. And it's important to notice differences because that means days are gonna be different and things can get better, you know? And and so that also ties in with how some people feel that they are always in this negative mental space. Idbarit, what's up, buddy? Welcome, man. And it can get to a point where, where the person thinks thinks that that's associated with who they are. That that's a part of who they are, being, you know, being depressed and always being in that mind space. That's not true, right? We know for a fact that our, our state of mind can change quickly, right? And so it's a mistake, both a strategic mistake and an empirical mistake to say that things are exactly the same every day and that, you know, like a, a specific mental state, like a negative mental state is inherent to who you are. So don't do that to yourself. <laughs> if you're doing that shit, stop it. Stop it. <laughs> oh. Suvi says, I found a cockroach in the pile of shit I was shoveling. <laughs> Great message. I'm glad it resonated with you, Unkai, and thank you again for the for the gift bombs. I hope everybody enjoys their emotes, and I hope everybody is fucking ready, guys. I hope you're fucking ready, because we are going into the game. Ah, it's Rage 2. Ha! Okay, why don't we try this? Uh, we could try moving our our stuff a little bit. No. See, the, the trouble is, I can't really... If I Alt-Tab, it removes some of those indicators. I was thinking that maybe it would look cool to have things... ...line up. Like so, maybe? What do you guys think about that? Does that look cool? It looks like maybe it's a bit in the way. Hmm. Was it better where it, where it was? <laughs> I'm not sure. Um, let me know what you guys think. I'm. A, I mean, it kind of looks cool because it's similar, isn't it, to the to the HUD? But anyways, hello, ODM. Welcome in. What is up? I'll be lurking now. See you soon. See you soon. Enjoy your lurk, Suvi. Okay. Uh, dude, the, the game looks fantastic, guys. Game looks fantastic. Look at this. The real question is, where have I parked my car? The legitimate question, isn't it? <laughs> where have I parked my car? Oh, I think that's the merchant. Yeah, that's the merchant. Okay. If we look at the map, do we see where the car is? Hmm. Convoy? Doesn't look like we can see where our car is. That kind of sucks. Okay. Well, let's go to... What do we want to do? So many possibilities. The Ruined Shaft. This is the mission I did last time. 
the ruined shaft. Minnie is waiting patiently for her very late food as the delivery is coming soon. Yeah, B Basil gets very cranky if he doesn't get his his food. Here's my thinking, guys. If I'm able to go exactly where the, the prior mission was, maybe my car will be there, you know? That's what I'm hoping for, at least. Because I have this cool monster truck. And I really want to rock that, but I don't know where it is exactly. But if you're new, I'm really enjoying the game. And I think it looks... Fa oh, there it is. Yeah, okay. It looks fantastic. It plays phenomenally well. Johnny rages live. <laughs> Mark Lark, thank you for that host, my friend. Let me just move this, guys, a bit to, to the side. I'm not convinced with where it's at the moment. Let's try it out over there. Uh, so, Rage 2, when we left off, we unlock a bunch of new skills. Did you rebind your nanite key from control? No, I'm, I'm, I'm using control for now. It's not too bad. I do have a few key binds on my mouse to help out with things. But nothing too crazy. What is the... What is this? MBTV balloon? Let's go check it out. Mark Larsama! Welcome to the channel, my friend. What is up? Is it, did, we, did we make it to the balloon already? Oh yeah, look at that. I don't know what we can do with the balloon, if anything, so we'll leave it off for now. What is this? Authority Sentry. Let's try to take that down. That is a massive car. Holy balls. How are you, Johnny? I'm doing phenomenal, dude. Thank you for asking and thank you for being here. I found control did not work with the abilities too well in the heat of things. Changed it to a mouse button. Uh, well, the, each person is going to have their, their own setup, right? Because, like, for example, I like having... Oops. Woo! Rage Drift. Uh, I like having F on my mouse, actually. Which I know is kind of unusual. But uh, ever since I played Borderlands, I got used to having it there. So it wouldn't make sense for me to have control there because I, you know, I use some of those buttons on the mouse. So I would have to press two buttons on the mouse. Uh, so control works so far. Shit. Shit. No. Oh. Get out. No. No! 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 Re Unka Ed! You madman! My god, that's amazing! Beyond Retro Games, Spot of Luck, Mustline, Beat the Bullet, and Ta TV. Welcome to the fort! Thank you very much, Unka, for those gifts. Guys, enjoy your emotes, your loyalty paws. What, what, what incredible generosity, my friend. Thank you very much. Oh, oh get up there. Oh, okay, there we go. Go back up. Hello, sir.
Okay. So. We want to take you down. Thank you for the shout out, ODM. Appreciate it. Are we doing good damage with that? Yeah. I got a gift without even being online, must line. <laughs> it's the generosity of Unka Ed. Thank you again, Unka. And welcome, Mustline. Thank you for checking out the stream, my friend. Enjoy your emotes. And your loyalty paw. Ouch. Die! Fuck your defenses! Yes! Sentry, we put its name to the test. Arctech Core, a rare Ar Arctech Core. Bring it to Cyber Dock in Wellspring to augment yourself. We haven't gone to Wellspring yet, but we have a couple of things already that we can do there. Welcome, everybody. How is it going? Oh, it's been a long day for me. I haven't had a chance to watch the Game of Thrones episode yet this week. And I just, I can't wait to check it out, but it's, I haven't had the time, you know? Okay, we got the container. Um, let's maybe respawn our car, because maybe, I think we lost it, didn't we? Lost it all together. Okay, let's do this. Let's respawn it. I can't wait to watch it. And of course, as usual... Uh, spoilers are just raining down on the internet, so the longer I wait, the, <laughs> the greater the risk. If you hold control, then you see a beacon to nearby arcs, right? Okay, I, I, I do know that. I was going to just do... Gotta exit our vehicle for that. Uh, I was going to just do some of the missions, but... Might be worth checking out if we have something nearby. Looks like over there. Not too far. It's not a bad suggestion. Let's go check it out. I remapped that to my mouse. Yeah, so... Yo, Ford, welcome back. What's up, man? Walker, listen. We're still gonna meet Mayor Lusum, right? I've already done that camp. Uh, you know, this is a game where everybody's gonna have quite different, quite unique setups when it comes to the keybinds, I feel. Let me lower the volume a little bit, guys. It's a bit loud on my end. One sec. Go like this. Um, because... There are so many, you know, little commands and stuff. And everybody, the, I guess the beauty of PC is that everybody has the ability to customize things to a great, you know, to a great extent. What is... There's one down there. It looked like it was closer, than, didn't it? That one does not look close. But maybe we can do a little bit of cross cross country. Oh yeah. Oh, here we go. Like the good old Skyrim horse. Let's go. Look at that, there's some animal life. Some bison looking dudes. What's going on, Norwegian imposter? What's up, buddy? Sorry I missed your initial comments there. I'm finding it very enjoyable, man. What about you? Have you had a chance to play it quite a bit? 
can you drive in first person? You know what? I don't think you can for it. It's a good question. I do like driving cars in third person because a, a, a big part of the enjoyment for me is looking at the vehicle, you know, and seeing what it looks like. Give me a second, guys. Just a, adjusting my audio levels. One thing that's... I don't, do we have any streamers here? I know Michelle streams, Norwegian streams. Uh, so we got a couple of these. One big thing, guys, and if I... Because I'm, I'm a big sound guy, obviously, right? If I had to give one piece of advice, sound-wise, aside from getting a decent mic, I guess, is make sure you have real-time monitoring and you can hear yourself as you speak. Because two things are going to happen if you can't hear yourself. One, you're going to scream. <laughs> you're going to speak louder than necessary. And two, you're not going to be able to modulate your voice. And, you know, if I'm hearing my voice, I can kind of control where I want to take it, you know? It's the same principle behind, uh, you know, singers. They need to also hear themselves because they need to be able to control their voice very well. You know, it's very hard to tell the distance to these, uh, to these beacons, isn't it? So I'm a little bit reluctant to just follow them eternally, you know? Don't really want to do that. Look at that, we got like a badass convoy. I don't necessarily want to engage them too much. In fact, one of the things that I'm really liking in the game is the fact that you can so easily disengage from combat. <clears throat> like, for the most part, they're not really that interested in you, personally. Which is both a relief, but also surprising, isn't it? Because we're supposed to be the only ranger left. And yet, somehow, they're not all, like, striving to kill us and stuff. Speaking of that, though, our car is fucked. Sorry, buddy. Is that an arc? I do like the, the environments. I think it looks so good. Maybe I'm a sucker, you know, but... I'm very, very happy with how it looks. Did I lose the beacon? Oh, it's right over there. Okay. I think I might leave my... C nah, let's take the car. I'm, I'm worried, you know, if my car blows up. I don't know what, what sort of repercussion that has. Can you repair the car? I don't know, actually, what happens. I think you can just respawn another one. Hopefully. Uh... Usually in front and use powers. Oh, like that, you mean? Mm. Do we have anything? Any sort of powers for cars? I know that we had some abilities. Uh, projects? Vehicle extension? No. Unlock. I don't think we had anything. Pit stop. We don't have those yet. I don't think we have anything. Certainly, you know, if this blows up, I would assume we can respawn it. Abzi is back. Has returned. My dude, how was your experience with the game yesterday? And more importantly, how are you doing today? Oh. Is that a secret entrance? No. <laughs> it, it's positively not. Okay. What are we looking... 
Okay, I swear the beacons keep getting further and further away, guys. Okay. I'm not gonna be chasing beacons. Look at how far we are. That's crazy. Undiscovered location. I mean, there is a location right here, but doesn't seem like we can enter it. Okay, can we fast travel to the city? How does it work? Fast travel, there we go. First time for everything. <laughs> Looks like it's, it's just the starter car. No, this is not the starter car. That was, um... Good luck out there. This is the starter car. Phoenix, I believe. What do we want to do? We got some main missions. Ground control. I kind of want to do... What is the other one underneath this? Come on, buddy. John Marshall wants you to help an old friend out. Why don't we do that? And let's make sure we're tracking that as well. Would it be in log? I think so. No. You go here and then... Okay, we're, we're already tracking that. Fantastic. Let's just take this vehicle. Watch it, Walker. We'll head out. Oh. oh, okay, okay. I gotta say, the driving sometimes it doesn't feel spot on. It's not bad, but sometimes it feels pretty slow, and then other times it feels not very yes, responsive. To be honest, the skidding is nice. The drifts are nice, like as you can see here. But uh, but turning in general. Maybe it's that the cars I have are pretty shit. Could be that as well. But uh, the turning is not... It's not very responsive. Also, I recommend... At least I removed the, the thing where it centers the camera around the car all the time. Just found it so hard to... So annoying, you know? To be fighting the camera all the time. A lot of understeer. What is understeer? What is this lingo? Holy balls. Annihilator. Vehicle combat. Some vehicles have energy shields, which are resistant to regular weapons. Upgrade the Phoenix with the blast. To deal with them effectively. So in other words, you're saying we need to have a blast... Moving on, right? <gasps> Dude, is that a ramp? You gotta do it. If you don't live for that kind of stuff, what the fuck do you live for? Let's go! Oh! Woo! Where are we going? My GPS is not updating. <laughs> oh, there it is. Sweet jump, dude. I know, right? What are you playing these days, Marklar? Because I know you... I think you finished most... Most stuff in, in Sekiro, right? I know you beat the game for sure. Michelle enjoying this game? Nice. It's one of them bandit dens again. How far have you gotten? Also, what kind of build are you thinking? Uh, are you uh, are you a shot shotgun kind of gal? That's more like my vibe. Going shotguns, melee attacks, close range, deep flanks, action. You know, it's kind of my jam. Let's uh, let's just park our car here for safety. We're here, store. Still have two endings to get for Sekiro. I wanna play this next though. 
want some sweet jumps. I would say, like, go into this for the gameplay because it's fucking fantastic. But it doesn't seem like the story is something, you know, to write home about. Hey, John Marshall sent me. Said you two go back? Yes. I know John well. And I know you, Walker. I've heard good things about you. John sent you to help me. Deep Schwamp used to be quiet. Stray humans kept to themselves. Mutants started killing randomly. To please their death god. Mutant superstition. <sighs> the killings made the river hog start stirring, leaving hog territory, muscling in on deep swamp. <sighs> you saw the dead hogs outside. You understand. To stop the hog invasion, I ask you. To go into the mutant caverns. Destroy their death god fetish. Kill the mutant death god to stop the hog invasion. That makes a strange kind of sense to me. I'll see what I can do. Okay, let's do it. I mean, the, the voice acting is good so far. You know, there's some interesting characters for sure. Got this guy sounded, sounds baked. <laughs> True. True. Now, one thing that I kind of dislike is that the compass actually shows you all of the, you know, different mission items that you have. Eliminate all river hogs. Okay. Like, if I look at this, where's my actual objective, you know? And we got three main missions. Now, to be fair, we do have our car over here, and as soon as we hop in, we're gonna get like a Systems activating. a pathway to to the objective, I think. Or will we? Oh, there it is. Is that it? Sorry, buddy. I don't know if I'm going the right way. Hold on. Hold on. No. There. Still getting used to some of the HUD and stuff. You can repair the car in the front. Let's see. Come back soon, Walker. Oh. I'll turn him into the clinic. Wait for me. There we go. Come back, Walker. Thank you, Michelle. Good. I didn't see the option with the other car. Pink lighting is a great touch. It's cool, right? Um... The, the idea is that, that like, depending on the game, would get, like, slightly different lighting to match. If it was Doom, I would go red, you know? Not sure you can do that with other cars. Good point. Maybe this car actually has that as a unique property. It didn't seem like I could do it with the monster truck. I did try. Eyeball in one sketchy looking place. Yeah, things ain't Vineland safe no more. Go in prepared, Walker. Surprise, motherfucker. Uh. 
I actually find myself sometimes a bit overwhelmed because there are so many options. Like movement wise, you know, you got the dashes, you got the slide, which I love both of them. But sometimes there's so many options, you know, it's like option paralysis. Kind of thing. That didn't work. <laughs> oh no. Kick that bitch. Okay. He's a little hairy. You got dogs as well? Fuck. Relation. Oh no. I fucked up. I have no heals left. That's a wrap. Johnny slays live or gets slayed in the process. Uh, okay, let's do this. Standby mode initiated. Hello, buddy. Oh, that dude. Is he immune to that? I'm also out of grenades. It sucks. Where's the woman? So... I don't know how to deal with the big dudes. Maybe the barrels? We can get him a little closer to the barrels? Maybe this area is a little bit too high level or something. Nice kill. Cheers, man. Aha. Seems like he's immune to that shit. Oh, fuck. Defibrillation! I'm not dead. What? No! Oh. Okay. I think we're fucked, guys. Hold on, can we craft some grenades? Might be a good idea to come back when you have more weapons and powers. Hmm. We have some Feltrite, actually. Maybe we can unlock some new goodies. Why don't we do that? And then, how do I... Hold on. There we go. Why can I not unlock this? Confused. I have the felt right, don't I? Have to use keys to select it. You gotta say the menus sometimes they you know they they don't do a great job.
Okay. Oh, there we go. Okay. Uh, armor breaker shot. Yes. No, we don't have enough mods. Ugh. We have six project points. Is there anything we can do with that? Anything that would go through armor. Printing reload, that's good. Precise critical strike. Top spin grenade tennis. Yeah, the, the menu is a bit off-putting sometimes. It's not too bad. Just could be a bit better. Reduced shakes and blur when taking damage is not bad. I don't see anything that's going to help me right now. Already taken those. Ouch. Stop shooting me. What do we do, guys? We're fucked. Can we craft any uh, health infusions? Yeah, actually. Okay, what about grenades? We got two grenades to work with. Danny Owen, gamer. Welcome back, buddy. Digging the game so far, man, for sure. Oh. Oh, fucking hell. That was not what I meant to do. I've actually changed some of the hotkeys, so... Middle mouse button now for throwables. Okay, that got him. What? Surprise doggo. Oh no. The the reload. Oh the timely reload. Oh man. Oh, man. We do have our grenades. Surprise, sir. Aha. Uh -huh. Those are down. Here we go. Why doesn't it work? I'm trying. Okay. Can somebody explain to me why the push attack doesn't work anymore? Oh. Death by hyena. You have weapon mods to make it faster reload. Yeah, I actually have that. It had to charge up. Man, it's a long cooldown, isn't it? That felt like a very long cooldown. I only got one. Okay. okay. All right, buddy. Stop my god What happened? What happened to your head? Oh my god, it's so many enemies. Oh I think this is too difficult for now. 
at the very least I need to like become better more conf more confident with the controls and stuff uh, oh what the fuck dude like a, a hover boat I mean not like a hover boat is actually a hover boat okay sorry sir have it's a level five i feel like we should be able to do a level five i don't know man i don't know i mean that's a level six we're gonna be fucked in that i think i'm just bad <laughs> okay i think i'm just bad guys so let's go back in and fucking try again I think one big problem is I'm I, I am very low on on like sustenance. I have like one heal, two grenades. Let's do another grenade, I think. One thing we can try to do though. Stop. How are you shooting me already? Oh my god. Uh one thing we can try is to uh counter grenades we actually have the perk that does it oh fuck it's so many dudes i mean to be to be fair to myself i've never fought this many guys in this game so it's like Definitely a step up to what we've done so far. Maybe if we wait here, let them come to us. Could be a better strategy. Shooting me from above? Get fucked. You think we can actually use the same strategy? It's a dude fest. Yeah. So many dudes. Do you think they can actually come up here? Maybe they can't. not that easy to hit them from here actually feels like we're better off taking our chances down here ah i wanted to send that grenade back don't have any health infusions ah i wanted to slide out of the attack but no such luck Try to get some distance. Ah. Fuck off! How many dogs do you have, man? Oh, okay. Let's try a different mission. I'm getting a little bit flustered with this one. Let's try something different. Unka Ed with another gift bomb. My God. You madman, you beautiful madman. Thank you very much, dude. Abzi, DVI, Marcus, Daniel, Wen, Gamer, Wilesy, and RZ Poetic. Enjoy your emotes, your paw, loyalty badges. 
Welcome to the gang. Feel the rage building. <laughs> I've played all the Souls games. This is nothing, man. What, dying three times? It wasn't even like that bad. Thank you very much for your generosity, my friend. And getting us over to that goal. Unlocking the new emote for everybody. Now here's a question for the chat room. Are you ready? We're gonna unlock one of the emotes that were higher tier not until now. So right now we have these three available for all of you guys that have become subs. But we now have another slot so we can make either this one or this one available. So that's coming up thanks to Ed, Unka Ed. Always go for the cat. Screw the human. Therefore, the ladder, it berit. The face one, like the my judgmental Johnny face. So I guess the good thing is anytime somebody says something silly that you question, you can put that on the chat and it's like you're saying, what though? <laughs> Dracaris on Asda. <laughs> We're here, Stork. Good luck out there. I don't need luck. Kinda do, right? A little bit. Laguni. Swamps. Laguni. Get it? Cause it's goons. So it's it's Laguni. Cause it's it's goons. Let's see if I can find anything about Dr. Kvasi here. Bring uh, it oh. right over. I wanna see <gasps> How you doing? Whoa! A ranger! With a Swedish shit ranger ride! Far out! <sighs> Auto parts. Hi, I'm Jinx. Are you to upgrade vehicles? Let's get that junk rolling. Rolling. Oh, let's take a look. I haven't looked into upgrading any vehicles yet. Can't call here. I don't know how to upgrade them. View upgrade. We can upgrade this one. Okay. It's why my nephews called me when they were young. That's cute. Did Moobot write that one? <laughs> it kind of sounds like it, right? Safe mode prevents your vehicle for, from being destroyed. Oh. Blast. Hold and then release. Ooh. Cruise missile. Okay. Reinforce chassis. Ejector seat. Oh, that's awesome. Ha! <laughs> oh, man. Nanotrite skin. Hellfire Mortar. Uh, well, how much, my lady, are you charging for auto parts? A little bit pricey, isn't it? We got five. You know what? We could buy some, but for now, I'd rather focus on myself. Rather, what are you... Are you okay? Welcome back, ODM. Mr. Subfest, look at that. We're at 41 sub points. That's crazy. Thank you again, my friend. It means a great deal. Hey. Ground control to Master Tom. Ranger. 
major town. I haven't you seen understand. a ranger in a long, long time. We fought back to back, your kind and mine. Back in the war. Name's Mo Rummy. I'm just an old vet who keeps an eye out for the people of Laguni. Been living here a good long time now, and I know just about everyone. Do you know anything about a Dr. Kvasir? Scientist? Real old? Haven't heard that name since just after the war. He moved into the deep secreto, and then went completely Basil, off the don't bite my foot, buddy. Stop. Since. Anything else you can tell me? Well, the area around his base is usually awful quiet, on account of the heavy old security. But lately, there's been a whole lot of noise coming from that part of the wetland. Okay, I'm gonna check it out. Ground control to major town. My god, lady, wash up a little. The fuck? Okay. Have you given us a mission? I wasn't fully listening. I'm gonna be honest with you. We have an undiscovered location. Log. What do we have? Active? There we go. Find Dr. Kvasir. Okay, go to map. Oh, there we go. There it is. Okay. You a basher? I'm gonna be one soon. Well, you, you're like a discount cyclops. Deep, deep sale cyclops. Oh, dude, a new car. Look at this. Oh yeah. Woo. Oh, it has no guns. Seems to be fairly fast, though. I was chatting with my good friend uh, Medusa Moon, fellow streamer, by the way. You should check her out. And she does uh, these meal preps. Another no, 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 no. Almost got hit by the sentry. Um, she does these meal preps. And if you don't know exactly what I mean by that is the idea that you, you know, you prepare a bunch of food on one day, stuff that's not gonna go bad, you know, like rice, chicken, you know, that kind of stuff. And then throughout the week, you're basically uh, mix and matching, you know, and, and doing different meals with those with the things that you prepped up. And uh, that's a very interesting... Hold on, let me just adjust my mic here. Uh, that's like a really interesting idea. I know my dude Barabas, also a sub here, uh, does it. And it's something I want to try, actually. Has anybody tried that in the chat? More like a comet appearing now and then. <laughs> Watching you has swayed me to stream tomorrow. You're a very inspiring person. Tugging at the heartstrings a little bit, Michelle. Thank you very much. Uh, but the meal prep is a, is a fascinating idea because... Not only is it very efficient, right? Because you spend some time cooking like one day and then it essentially streamlines your meals for several days. But also, I think it allows you to be very creative because all of a sudden you got a lot of different um, like meal components that you can quickly, you know, warm up and put together and piece together something more complex than you normally would. I'll stop you, Marklar. No! I blame you, Marklar-sama. 
I'm just joking, of course. I take full ownership over all of my acts. Oh! Please! Skyrim horse! Go! Yes! Thank the lords of Winterfell. Mubot says, what creature is smaller than a talking parrot? A spelling bee. It's pretty bad, man. Okay. We have arrived, I think. Running fairly low on ammo here, but I'll be okay. Dude, you're a spiritual being. I don't know what. What do you mean? In what? <laughs> in what way? Have I ascended the physical realm? Yes. Where are you? Slow. Hello, sir. Oh yeah. I always forget to watch the cooldowns. Oh. That's friendly? <laughs> oh. You dummy. You dummy. You. Yes, you in your ranger uniform. Step closer, Fuck? please. <laughs> the box. Yes, the one with the cactus. Oh. A smiling succulent with a hat. Yes. What the fuck? I came looking for a Dr. Kvasir here. There you are. Let me just... I see. Uniform is wartime issue. Modified for use in ecopod fortification. Vineland, no? Then you must be... Yes. Second generation artist. How fascinating. Vineland, yes. I'm pretty much what's left of it. Hmm. You check out. Hold on. I will let you in. I don't know why, but <laughs> it's so funny and ridiculous the fact that's like a a talking small cactus. And the only moving part is this like head piece. <laughs> it's so ridiculous. I do like the pink touches in the game. I think it works pretty well. Uh, it contrasts greatly with the rest of the color scheme, doesn't it? So whenever you have stuff you can interact with, the fact that it's pink, it's... You know, it stands out a lot. It's been too long since I played host to one of your kind. Dr. Anton Kvasir, genius scientist with a shifty past, original archist, pre-Apophis. They say he worked for the Authority and helped create their mutant soldiers. Then he turned on his masters, joined the cause, fought alongside my folks in the Authority War. I'm not sure how I feel about mad scientists at this point, but I do need his help. What the fuck it's, is he uh, writing? It's an impressive setup. Uh, Dr. Kvasir? Kvasir. My yes. god. My lab suffices. Legs. You monster, what have you done? The research used to be more mechanically inclined. But over time, the machine, as it turns out, failed. I prefer to rely now on genetically engineered solutions, simply because they can heal. Makes sense, I guess. 
I hope you don't mind, Walker, yes? I put your scan through my ARC mainframe. I know you now. Your parents. Such a tragedy when they were lost. But Arvina proudly took you in, no? She did. As if I was her own. But they killed her. They destroyed everything I ever knew. Dead? Oh no. She was... formidable. I'm sorry, I can't stop looking at the hoping. vagina monster he's riding. But, alas, no. It was a massacre. An unstoppable force. Mutants, a new kind of creature. All tech and armor and guns. And huge. Taller than any building. And they were led by a man. General Martin Cross. Oh, he is back then. It was to be expected. Him and his lapdog scientist, Dr. Bendros, were always hard at work on their longevity project. But you see, for that problem, I just might have some solutions. Solutions? No, oh, I've got one for you. Project Dagger. Ah, you know. <laughs> yes, of course you do. Prowley must have told you already. It will be easy for me to do my part. The project was always equal parts action and science. Come back in about uh, oh, six years or so. Then I will have concocted the nanotritery programming agent, or serum, as I prefer to call it. Whoa, did you just say six years? Yes, thereabouts. The science cannot be rushed. Six years, so I'm gonna go play some Persona. And be right back, right? Only the elusive Eco 15 still in orbit could provide the computing power to speed up this process. The Ecopod's still in orbit? Been hearing about that since I was a kid. Yes, it was a miscalculation. Remained on the firmament as the others came tumbling down. If Eco 15 was to be forced down, I could tap into the processing power of that ancient supercomputer. Think of it, to siphon that brute computing force into my poor old laboratory. Is there any way to force it down? Hmm, yes. It can be done from the Eden Space Center. Then I'll do it. Yes. Yeah. Wait a minute. You knew I was going to volunteer to do it, didn't you? Yes. Dude, that was a way too long conversation. I've lost interest like halfway in. Also, I couldn't stop looking at the fucking vagina monster. What have you done to this poor fucking thing? Look at this. It's got two extra arms. It doesn't need them, does it? What the... I mean... It is just evil, dude. Can I steal anything from you? No. Okay. I wasn't gonna do it anyways, you know, I'm an honorable person, but... I was just checking if you had anything lying around to warn you about it, you know? Nah, I would've totally stolen it. See you later, buddy. Can we drop a save here? I think it's been a while. Looks like we do get... Wait, do we get auto saves? Maybe not. Maybe not. Okay. Reach the Eden Space Center. What are, what are we looking at? Eden Space Center. Does it not show us? Hold on. Go to map. Yeah, it is there. Okay. Man, that's really far. <laughs> well, let's do this. We're gonna go to base first. 
let's take the vehicle that we found here. If we can come back to our car, I don't know. Where is our car? Basically, if you, if you take a car and you bring it back to the city, you get to keep it. And, and then, like, you can summon it later on. So. Have I lost my car? God damn it. Am I going crazy? Why is there no icon for the cars? I don't understand. going nuts okay you know what i lost my car fast travel there's no shame in it i shall enter the phoenix and we're gonna go like this does the car despawn it berates i don't know maybe maybe it does maybe that's what's going on right maybe that's it because I, I thought I left it there. And sometimes it does show on the on the compass. Like if I leave right now. If I get out of my car. Stand there's an icon road. for it. It doesn't show in the actual Initiate. map. But it shows Systems on my compass. Activating. As they here, need to go unpack. Have a nice evening, Michelle. Enjoy the rest of your day. Give Minnie and Molly a, a good snuggle. And kisses to uh, to Molly by Basil, you know, or from Basil. Basil kisses. Another bandit pit stop. My... Oh. My little guy is biting my foot. Could you not, though, my son? Could you not chew on my foot? Why would you... Why would you even want to bite a foot, Basil? What is going on, buddy? We need to have a chat about those habits. I do like how different cars have different durations for overdrive, you know, different speeds and all of that. Also, guys, what do you think about the Plague Tales or Plague Roger. Tale? I'm approaching the Eden Space Center. Ah, yes. Game that came out. Might be overrun by road scum, come to think of it. But that will be no problem. It looked pretty slick. Ranger. No problem at all. Duh. Sorry about that. Oh, it's a sneeze. It looks pretty impressive, doesn't it, Danny? And it, it also looks like a great game for a stream where we can probably finish it in like two streams. Two, three streams. Crabs. How does the Twitch minigame work? Good question, Krabs. Uh, welcome to the stream, my friend. I think the way it works is you should have some kind of overlay. And when, when I die, you get to defibrillate me and reanimate me instead. Great graphics for sure. Yeah. Critics gave it good reviews. Come back soon, Walker. It's a nice change of pace, right? I agree. Yeah, it, it is quite nice to, to do. Oh, oh shit. Didn't realize. My bad. Oh. Excuse me, sir. Oh. 
Get him, boys. Where's the next fucker? Man, you're a tough woman. What the fuck? Woo! Uh, I love that. Rats. <laughs> any setup I do first, you shouldn't have to do any setup. It should be like an overlay if you. If you hover your mouse over the stream view, do you see something, crabs? We haven't really experimented with it too much, so you might be the first guinea pig. Doctor, I made it to the space center. It's in ruins, and like you said, overrun by thugs. It should pose no problem to you. And as for Eden, well, it was built to withstand anything. Let us get you proper access. Press palm to hand scan in the reception desk. What is that thing up there? Hmm. Huh. Just some lights. There we go. I think once you've installed the Twitch oh, extension for it, you can link your Twitch account to Bethesda. Now I've done that already. Full access. So that's something I do on my end, but the person watching shouldn't have to do it. That makes sense. Hello, buddy. How's it going? <laughs> Did you see that? She was shooting from under her leg. That's so silly. I love the shotgun, it's so good. Commander in Chief, President Ranger Walker. President? Huh, I like the sound of that. Ah, yes. Better to take no chances. Now you have full access. President, the EcoPod mission control is on the third floor. Mr. On Xbox right now? But if you get in trouble, I'll see. Yeah, let let's let's hope it doesn't happen too often, right? <laughs> Are there any other things that the extension does, or is it just a defibrillation thing? You guys know. Uh, I think if I remember correctly, hello, hello. Uh, I think if I remember correctly, if you do a race, the names of your viewers were, will appear as other racers, you know? Which is pretty cool. Yeah. 
Where is she? There it is. Who else do we have? It's just a defibrillator. Is it PC only? Do you mean the extension or the game? The extension should be... Should work everywhere as far as I know. Thank you for the follow, crabs. Appreciate it. How are you enjoying the game so far? My dude. Oh. Do I smell a chest? Indeed. Ooh, data pad. Exciting excavations, number 10. I fear my curiosity may be the death of me. My latest prize appears to be the brain of a titan zygote. Zygote? Zygote. Suspended in a jar of electrified salt water. The collection, it's so it's water that's been playing too much Dark Souls. Get it? It's salty. Right. The collection of this item has angered a swarm of goon squad bandits who have chased me into this very complex. I discarded it as I am able to carry it. As I'm unable to carry it and Pigeon has abandoned me leaving to my fate. As I <clears throat> left it to its fate, a small loudspeaker built into the lid screamed a final request at me. Kill me, it begged. With any luck, it will remain hidden amidst the trash. I can retrieve it once I've found a su suitable replacement for Pigeon. I understand. I will grab the Feltrite. What do you call a gorilla wearing headphones? Anything you like, it can't hear you. It's pretty bad. It's pretty bad. Bad Moobot. Surprise! Oh yeah. Did you see how I painted the wall with their, with their fucking bodies? That is nasty. Hello, buddy. Oh. At you. Fancy armor would be a shame if somebody popped it. I love how, you know, normally they use the color pink to indicate more or less where you have to go. That helps me a lot because I tend to get lost in levels very often you know excuse me sir very rude right these goons man no respect Who else do we got? Oh yeah, buddy. Make my day. Oh yeah. Man, the shoddy feels so good. When you go like this, and you just make fools pop, a mule welcome to the stream what's up hey do you know where i can get a free computer i know it's a long shot i do not alas but i hope what you can find is some entertainment and company here conversation 
<laughs> or a console. I mean, you know, an Xbox, a PS4. Access denied. Got some good deals on those now. You can get a lot of games to play in those suckers. Access denied. Access denied. Access denied. Thank you for repeating that. Uh, you know, I didn't catch it the first time, so I appreciate it. Oh god. So many. Oh. So many grenades. Man, that is a lot of dudes. Ah, ouch. No, no, no. No, 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 no. Too many dudes. Man, those fights are intense. I gotta say, I'm not the biggest FPS guy, so you know, it's it's a little bit... I mean, I've played Wolfenstein 2, several other just kind of pure FPS games, including Doom. But I'm not super used to this wealth of data having to be processed so quickly, you know? So... Getting used to some some of the tropes and the movement, but I, I'm digging it, man. It's very intense, very captivating. A victory. <laughs> what do you guys think of the commands we got so far? Uh, I do like this one. Like for someone, I guess when we get busted by by someone. But let me know if you have ideas for other recall possible reactions. Approved. Beginning Ecopod recall. Thank that you, we can do. President. May you bring about a new Eden. The music seems to indicate the that has entered the dudes Armed are gonna come. Indicate thermal shielding is uniform. Hmm. Man, that's cool. Whoa! Whoa! We need a tickle command? Love Busted being an MGS fan. I thought you might appreciate it, Markar. I know! And so does the authority! Hurry inside and activate it! I will handle the rest! Oh. Elevator's still running. So far, so good. Also, the bot does this thing where every now and then it will say, feed me, right? Because it's a cat. I think it would be cool if we had a feed command and then the, ca the cat basically has a thank you animation, you know? Doitashimashite in Japanese, right? Basically fluent in Japanese. So don't feel intimidated by it. That's okay. Better work. Johnny Sama. <laughs> oh. Yeah. 
here we are. You found it. Turn it on and let me handle the rest. That big supercomputer will soon be dancing to Kvasir's tune. It's all powered up. Everything seems to be in working order. Fantastic. The Dagger Project will now... I am getting a reading from outside the Ecopod. You have authority battle mutants homing in on your location. I'll take care of them. Kill the authority intruders. Where where are they? Okay. Where is the door? Oh, we gotta open with this? Uh, yeah, I forgot it was an elevator. You dummy. You dummy. Like FPS is holding up. Holy balls. Shit. Oh. Die, Aru. Dude, we're not doing any damage? What? 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 Is there some kind of gimmick? Hello, Pokato chan. What's up? <laughs> Hello. Hello. Dude, how? What? How do we kill this man? He takes no damage. How do we kill that thing? You guys got any ideas? I was thinking maybe hitting the, th the glowing thing on his chest, but... Ouch. That's a wrap. Like, even like this. Oh! Oh! He's got secret... Like, secret compartments.
busted, indeed. So he's got some stuff that we can pop on his suit. Reload, motherfucker. Getting hit by other shit. Oh, so hard. Is it Friday already? Uh, not as far as I know, but I have been wrong before. Here's the problem, we got all of these fucking regular dudes in the vicinity. Die! Now we're dead. Oh! I got a plan. You ready? What is the plan? You eliminate the basic dudes. And then you go for, for the main guy. There we go. Oh. Sorry, sorry. Doc said, Thor we go. Mutants. Shouldn't be a problem. Okay, so we got like more guys coming in. This is problematic. Problematic as fuck. Okay, let's try it again. Oh. Make it pop! Let's go! Give me another. Give me another. Oh! Give me another. Give me the chest. No! Here we go. Yes! What? He's still alive? Fuck. No. No. It's not working. 
Oh, I have no heals. Fuck! Can I cheese him a little bit? Doc, the authority mutants are no longer a threat. You're good to Wait. go. Has he done it? You surely are Prowley's successor. Right. So now you're gonna get... Neuronic interface. Bring to Cyber Dock and Wellspring to augment yourself. To finishing up your part of Dagger? Yes, oh. indeed. With this setup, it will be a breeze. Plus, plus, I will have ample time to prepare other feats of science which will be beneficial to you. Like? Ah, different projects of a scientific nature, all of which will help you get stronger and tougher, and ultimately be able to, how you say, kick the authority's butt? Sounds good to me. Projects. You have unlocked Kvasir's? Kvasir's projects. There we go. What kind of stuff you have? Infusion belt? Carry up to six health infusions. Ooh. I mean, I definitely want this. Let's grab this. What else do we have? Data pad tracking. Pick signal from data pads, enabling you to home in on their position using a... a, a whatever. <laughs> Strength signal indicator. I like that. Embedded Feltride Tracking. Ooh. Feltride Drill. Release more Feltride. By the way, for if, if, if people are new, Feltride is the main thing that allows us to upgrade stuff. And then there's a, a ton of other currencies as well that are used. Gonna go great stream. Have a good one. Idbarit, good night, my friend. I'll see you on the next one. Peace out. Vampiric Overdrive, immediately regenerate a bit of health on Overdrive activation. That's not bad, guys. Impact Absorption, be able to fall from higher heights without taking damage. Not bad. Nearby Loose Feltride automatically gravitates to your position. We're gonna grab that. It makes it easier for us. Storage Container Tracking. Let's pick that up. Because I'm pretty bad with finding those. And we're going to get the Vampiric Overdrive as well. And then for weapons, do we actually have something? Again, not in love with the menus necessarily. <laughs> I like the look of the menus. But navigating with the mouse is not really friendly. You know? Constitution. Uh, we don't have any nanotrite boosters. Yeah, okay. Crowd control to major time. Oh, yes, Sumi Natsai. Right, what, what she said. Save game. Very good. Oh, okay. Where do we want to go, guys? Where do we want to go? Fresh juice stop. Ooh. Destroy all fuel containers. You got a narc chest. Some containers. Let's do that. Sounds like fun. Do we have any vehicles to work with in the vicinity? That would be great. I'm sure there's gonna be something close. Love the look of that, man. The satellite dish. What is that structure there in the distance? Hmm. hmm.
Taking advantage advantage of it be to practice my Japanese. That's cool. Isn't it nice? Uh, finding someone you can speak that, you know, second, third or whatever language with to practice. It goes a long way, man. Because if you don't speak it, just it, it will never really become fluent until you speak it a ton. When I came to the UK, I, I already spoke English, but only when I came here, I realized how clunky my English was, you know? You can think you're very good until you start actually talking to people and quickly realize you're not that good. What is that sound? Is this a motorbike? Is this functional? No, I guess not. Oh, we're actually missing storage containers and a data pad in here. I think we ended up rushing through this area, you know? Let's comb through it. Hold the felt right. Oh, look at that Wi Fi indicator. That's the. That's what helps us find data logs and stuff. He speaks Nihongo. So go in there. Is that pink motorbike? <laughs> Want to learn Japanese so I don't have to read anime subtitles? That's the same with me, uh, Cat. I would really like that. I don't watch a, l a lot of anime, but when I do, I don't like reading subtitles. Any goodies over here? I love how much you can climb. It's pretty nice. Maybe there isn't anything else, like, exactly here, outside. Could be that everything is in here. Hold on, why can I not take that? Okay, there we go. I don't like that there is no pointer to where everything is. Yeah, I'm not the greatest at finding stuff, but to be fair, they do have a few perks, ODM, that help you find stuff, you know? We got a couple. But they haven't yet necessarily helped me out a great deal. What the fuck? I thought I killed everybody here. God, how is there so many guys again? Isn't that crazy? I just killed like 200 guys. Okay. I think I'm just gonna get out of here. I don't want to like redo this entire area. If 
If we've missed some stuff, listen, man. Life can be tough like that, right? Oh, I want to ride that bike, though. I was actually looking for an anime to watch. I've seen, you know, some of the classics like Death Note, Attack on Titan. What was the other one, Cat, that you recommended me? So, uh, Tokyo Ghoul. Tokyo Ghoul. There is another one that somebody mentioned the other day. Uh, is it Psycho Mob? No, Psycho. Something Psycho. Do you guys know that one? Did you see Blood Plus? No, definitely not. Doesn't ring a bell. Good luck out there. I don't need no luck, bitch. What else do we have? Hello, sir. These guys just chilling here. Crab says mob is good. Mob, right? Psycho mob? Is that right, Crab? Psycho mob, I heard that was really good. <clears throat> French is such a beautiful language. It is. But it's hard as fuck. So many accents. Very difficult. I found it at least. <gasps> it's a motorbike. What the... Hi, sir. Dude, a motorbike. Hello, Basil. What's up? Baby? Here's Basil. Hello, buddy. Hello, stream. Thanks for the help installed and linked. No problem, man. I'm happy to hear it helped out a little bit. How are you finding the game, Crabs? Having fun? Hey, <laughs> Hey, buddy. Okay, you wanna stay with me? You wanna play some Rage, buddy? Yeah? A little bit of lap action? Let's go. I wish there was a way to just pick up everything in the vicinity, you know, without having to go from thing to thing. And no, right, buddy? Yeah? No, 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 don't go up there. there we go. Oh, okay. Let's pop that as well. Mm. 
There's also an arc chest. Some oh, there's more stuffs over there. More stuffs. Surprise, motherfucker! That's a pop. Ooh, juicy arc chest. It's like a better crackdown. That makes sense. Ooh, two boosters. Nice. Dude, two boosters. Fuck yeah. Okay. Let's pop these. Goes out with a bang. Very nice. Let's try out the bike. Nipa. Oh. Oh shit. Hold on, let's head back to town. Because if we make it back to town, we can actually summon it whenever we want. God, stop it! A little bit hard to control. It's quite fast though. Oh shit. Sorry. It's a bit finicky to control for dance, sure. Man. So what do you guys think? Do you feel like setting up a Plague Tales stream soon? Oh shit. Because I'm thinking that could be pretty interesting to take a week to get through that game, you know? Look at that, the Nippa auto parts. Very nice. Come back soon, Walker. Looks like, oh, hold on. Looks like we have a data log somewhere, like an audio log. Oh. There it is. <clears throat> You want your ride gleaming and slick? Ride taking your vehicle to the edge today. Amazing. Amazing. Okay. What else? What What is next for us? We could go for one of these other missions. John Marshall wants you to help out a new friend. Authority Sentry, that seems too difficult. We got some level 6 quests. Uh, how about that? Or maybe this. Find Losum Hagar in Wellspring. Ooh. Track objective. Do we have that selected? Wasteland celebrity? Yep. Yeah. Okay. There we go. One thing I'm not too sure is how can I how can I spawn a different car in here? Do I have to pay every time? I think I have to pay every time. 
I don't really want to pay. <laughs> I'm very stingy, even if it's Activating. 10 bucks. I'm not, I'm not gonna be happy paying that. I gotta say this car so far feels the best one when it's when it comes to responsiveness and it's also a decent balance with, with like speed and stuff some of the others you know you got size you got power but then it's very difficult to navigate of those bandit dens it is a level five Ooh. you guys want to try that let's Stand try that mode initiated. i think we can try that <clears throat> try to go like sneak in That did not work. I thought I could man fight him. <laughs> and win. But I was wrong. Die, you fuck. Oh my god. I've made a terrible mistake. Oh. We got people everywhere shooting at us. Come on. Oh, the explosions. Oh! <laughs> the pop on that dude was real. Get fucked, sir. What else do we have? There he is. Who else? Who is next? Somehow I survived. If I turn the third and can't Good job, team. Our chest. Yes. Oh. Three weapon core mods. Oh yeah. So here's what's interesting. We in theory we unlocked a skill that allows us to to find containers more easily. I wonder how that works. Like right now we we're missing one container.
Mm, do you think it's safe to go down there? Maybe. What were you doing here? I don't understand. Wow. Water pump. Eliminate all goons. Nice. Still missing some stuff here. Okay, let's try to find the data log first. Because that seems a little easier. A little easier. No. So I'm just watching that Wi Fi signal thing. Take me back to three points. What? There we go. Gotta be somewhere in. Oh, there it is. Dolly the Datanator. Listen up, Meathead. You're gonna get a visit in a couple of days from Molly. She's gonna want to come in and have a drink. And you know that. You know that means she's gonna end up shooting up the place. I don't care what it costs. I want her running with us when we take Wellspring. That lady's a one-woman wrecking ball. And I want to see her blast a hole in this side of Hagar's town. She'll be easy to spot her crew. All wear triple thick armor just in case she decides to let loose with some of the high X goodness. Cool. So I assume that's the big lady we killed. First. Still got one container. I'm not happy leaving a container, guys. We gotta find that. Wasn't that skill supposed to help us? Let me take a look at that, because if we go to nanotrites... Nope, uh... Project. Search and recover. A tracker picks up the signal from storage containers, enabling you to <clears throat> to home in on their position using a signal strength indicator. Oh, so it's it's the same indicator, is it? Here we go. Getting strong, it's in here. <laughs> Up here? We should be like right on top. Maybe it's just very dark and I'm not seeing it, but... Oh, there it is. Yeah, it, it was very dark. Right. Got him. I don't want to go down there, I don't think, but maybe we can do this. Also, we have this skill that... We, we suspend in the air when, when we aim. Look at that. It's pretty neat. Pretty neat. Is a good hang time too. All right, good work, team. Yeah. Systems activating. I'm enjoying the dynamics, you know, I guess like the moment to moment great deal here. 
wellspring. There it is. Also, if we find the doctor in here, there's a bunch of upgrades. Well, very cool. Finally. Now let's see if we can't get a hold of Mayor Lusum Hagar. Rusty's auto parts. Let's maybe say hi to Rusty. Extra loop. Uh. Rusty Jr. We could buy some auto parts, but I think for now we'll leave it off. Yeah. That's some choice duds you got on there, bud. There's more to police in this place than just keeping roughnecks in check. Nobody gets in here looking like some wasteland slum scum. We got standards at Wellspring. Feel me? Film. <laughs> I love the hat. Oh, that is amazing. <laughs> oh man, look at that. Dude, that is some craftsmanship right there. What are you guys watching? Nice legs. A bounty. Ooh. Looks good. Lugs nuts. Tiny group of little ripping fuckers. Fantastic. <laughs> An arson party squad. Okay. Hey, I'll walk in. Whoop de do. Another wasteland Yoko lost in the big city. What can Sheriff Mako Kuru do for you? I'm a ranger. Here to help. Anything going on, Sheriff? Muties. Goddamn muties, as usual. <sighs> I sent a trigger team down the old tunnels to root him out. But they've only managed to rope him in. They lack the killing power to finish him off. Something's gotta be done, and soon. Or we'll have muties up top in no time. I'm planning on waiting in that shit like gun barrel. Interesting. Give me a save. And I think that's gonna be a wrap for today. I'm fairly tired, but we're going to pick this back up. I think this I'm really enjoying this, guys. Um, let me know. You know, it would be nice if you if you want to continue the conversation as to what we play next. Certainly Persona 5, you know, I'd be happy to return to that. And if I don't do it on stream, I'll do it on my own time as well. You look like tired. Yeah, I know. Sorry, ODM. I do kind of look like shit, but it's been a long day. And uh, it was fun though. Did you have that launch already? Uh, we had one today. There's another release tomorrow. And then there's like another bigger thing happening in a couple weeks. It's just been a very long time. <laughs> it's been a very long period. Uh, but nothing energizes me like spending time with you guys here. And I want to say thank you to everybody who continues to return. And make this a fantastic place to hang out for everybody. So... Thank you very much, guys. Thank you very much for Unka Ed as well for those gift bombs. It's very nice to, to, to get a lot of you joining us here. For anybody who's a new sub, make sure to join our Discord. There's a zone in there just for subs. And I share all of the music that I produce with you guys. And you get a say in, in you know, in, I guess, what I do with, with new tracks and which direction we take and all of that good stuff. So make sure to join us in the Discord. Outside of that, we're coming back on Friday with the ACG International Podcast and on, sa and, and on Saturday with our 2 p.m. stream for more goodness. Thank you, everybody, for being there. Who shall we raid today? Uh... My dude Gao Level is a great he's a great streamer guys. Fire Rat has subscribed with Twitch Prime. What's up Fire Rat? Thank you so much for the subscription my friend. I was just saying any new subs join us in the Discord where there's a special zone for subs where I share the music I'm making with you guys. Dude, thank you very much for the sub. Looking forward to getting to know you here in the next streams. Wow, crazy sub day, guys. Okay, let's uh, let's do Medusa today. She's doing Gary Mod, which is like an interesting... Oh no, hold on. 
we got uh, Kawaii Foxita doing Destiny 2. You gotta do it. You gotta do it, guys. You gotta do Foxita. She has a, a delightful stream and incidentally also a delightful British accent. It's very pretty too, which doesn't hurt, does it? Little eye candy to go with the awesomeness. Thank you everybody for being there. And as always, I'll catch you next time. Bye-bye.